Welcome back to The Witness. I had to admit defeat a little bit last time. I want to wrap things up neatly, but the game said no, because this this one, this puzzle we are staring at right now, is apparently a lot more complicated and involved than I was expecting. I have no idea how this is gonna work, unless it's just as simple as, like... It, it could just be... Get the boat to be the other way around, and then you're fine. But that's kind of easier said than done at this point. Yeah, and then, like, you need to also have all this perfectly in line as well, which is kind of insane. And I guess maybe you have to sit here waiting for it to, like, spin around, and then you can go up? Oh, boy. I don't even know, but let's... I, th th this is the annoying part, because I can't have this dock here again. That's not possible, so... I mean, I guess I can just take it for a ride, and that'll be fine. If it is just supposed to sit here... But it can't sit here, because it has to... It has to pass it, right? And that seems crazy. This seems absolutely insane. Oh, fuck. Because how can you possibly align the boat passing by here with the, like, buoy thing spinning. I don't know, that... I don't understand. Let's just park it normally and we'll see. Because, yeah, otherwise I guess I'll have to do what I said, where I, like, take it over here and then send it on its way, but it'll, it'll have to be, like, literally the slowest possible speed, I would imagine. Which is gonna be insane. Why did I not go the closest way? I have no idea. I remember even thinking that there was something to this fucking thing, but like, it just seemed like nothing. Because I guess it's just so hard to notice that, and just... even when you notice it, that's not enough. There's more to it than just noticing the puzzle itself. Yeah, because we don't have the start point, and the start point has to be on the boat. Because this is like the last time we can even use it, and finding out that there is a start point on the boat means it has to be that. But I mean, surely it has to be the other way around, where it's like going... going this way, because now I can't see that end point at all. Oh, there, wait, really? There is another puzzle involving the boat? Holy shit, because I don't think we've used the, the backside of the boat, right? I don't remember doing that, but okay. Alright, so it's not... It's nothing like that insane. I just have to uh, line these up. Uh, how, though? Yeah, not like that. Ooh, maybe... Maybe they do have to line up a bit better. Or maybe, maybe I just have to wait for it to rotate. Oh, like there. Wait. Yeah, like, if it... Oh, no. If it rotates along a little bit, maybe. Come on. Is that not it? Oh, no. I No, I had it. Damn it. I had it. Okay, all right. Just have to wait for it. That didn't look like it would work. I thought you would have to, like, align these endpoints perfectly. Man, this fucking boat. There's just too much with a fucking boat. I keep thinking, like, oh, now we're done with the boat, I'll never use it. And then it's just, nope, more puzzles. Gotta have more with a boat. There we go. All right. And then we have to just sit here and wait for it to turn around again. Yeah, that makes sense. All right. Well, thanks, E-Guide. That was very helpful because I would have been wandering around in the fucking forest for hours if I didn't have this kind of hint. And there we go. Good lord. Yeah, what an insane one. At least it wasn't 
as insane as I thought, where we had to, like, have the boat going along the slowest possible speed, while, like, from there, from over here, while I ran all the way around coming in here, and then, like, perfectly aligning it with this spinning at the same time, that, that would have just been impossible. But okay, that's good. Again, now the question is, how the fuck do we use the back of the boat? So that surely must be related to the uh, river obelisk, right? Or the mountain one. Because there is no other obelisk left. So that has to be the last one. Unless I'm just forgetting. Maybe I've already used it. It's just there's a lot of uh, environmental puzzles. Maybe I just can't remember all of the ones I've used. No idea. But anyway, let's uh, turn these platforms back the way they should be. So I can actually like travel back and forth. And then we'll take another look at the uh, white obelisk here now. So this one... I guess I could have this one, uh, yeah, like, I don't need this one turned this way. It could go right, uh, straight forward, but, yeah, that's how I had it before. I guess either way, it doesn't really matter. I just need to turn this one around. So we want to go right, I suppose. Make me fall off, please. Damn it. And then here we do, what was it again? This kind of thing, yeah. And there it is, shining splendid, fantastic. All right, we haven't been at the lake in a while. Maybe I should just swing by there, because I mean, obviously it's just five fountains at this point, but I don't know if anything else has changed. That'll change even more once I get the, uh, the final one. Yeah, look at them go. Five beautiful fountains. One here, two, three, four, and five. And we have one final one here. That's not doing so well. Yeah. Alright, well, let's get up to the mountain. Might have to use the uh, e-guide a little bit to... Remember all of the puzzles I've gotten here to see if there's any connection. Here we are. So we have three here. None here, none here, none here, none here, one there. And this one is... Oh god, where is this one? I, like, I remember that. Is that all the way up at the mountain? The top of the mountain? Where you, like, go up? No. I don't know, but yeah, uh, people confirm these are the, uh, the laser, uh, light bridge puzzles. So that makes sense. This is the first one, and this is the, uh, second floor one. Yeah. I think I've even mentioned that before. And here, where are we facing from this side? Like, down this way? But that might be... Yeah, it might be in the swamp, or it might be, like, underground. It seems like it's the swamp. Yeah, isn't this the one on the spinning platform? That shadow? I think so. I'm just gonna look these up really quick to remember. Alright, there we go. I've looked them up. So, this one is actually in the greenhouse, or the bunker. I don't remember exactly where it was, even reading the solution. I couldn't remember, but I guess we'll go back there and, and check. And then these ones... Again, the order is a little weird, because, like, we have this one, which is where I went underneath in the swamp, like, down in one of the basements. The last one with the, like, weird Tetris puzzle. And this one is the one where you, like, go and stand to the left and, like, angle it so you can see out to the right in the window. And then the, uh, the shade will be the right shade and then you... or the color will be the right shade, rather. And then you can complete this. But then this one is the opposite one, where you look from the right side 
to the left and get it. So, like, why weren't these just side by side? I don't know. That's kind of strange. And then this one is the, uh, the rotating T platform. And interestingly enough, he actually mentions on this one... Uh, this is easily one of the more complicated and frustrating puzzles to achieve. It will most likely take you more than a couple of tries to get it right. Kind of surprising, because I just got it in one go, and I even thought I was, like, mispositioned, so I would have to do it again the first time, and I was like, oh, I'll, I'll just do this again, and then it just happened to work anyway, so I guess that was some dumb luck, just getting the perfect position that didn't even feel like the perfect position. But yeah, there we go. So I know where these are, and then this one is in... This is the, like, pool of water next to the end place, like, the mountain. Uh, I mean, we can we can kind of see it. Ah, no, we can't. But, you know, over here, the round pool of water that, like, eluded me for so long, and then I finally found it where it's, like, up the way to the mountain when you're going past a tree or something. That's when you look down. So so that's cool. And, yeah, that's, that's it. And then these ones, in that case, must be related to... The mountain or something similar. These are very angular and stuff, so... Hmm. I don't really know, but yeah, let's let's go for this one to begin with. Man, already this is getting uh, on the longer side. Not, not longer, but like... We're definitely gonna need at least one or two more episodes completing this one. This obelisk. But yeah, let's uh, head over to the greenhouse, quick. It's not... Is it here? Hold on. I don't remember using the boat thing, but none of those puzzles look like they would be the boat thing. Wait, do they? Maybe. Like, this one could be the boat? That could be the boat. Hold on, so let's summon the boat here. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. It, maybe it's not here. Maybe it's at the, uh... What's it called? I, I always forget the name. The swamp. But then I would have to, like, go... Here. For a little bit. So, yeah, I don't see any puzzle-looking things here on this one. But we just do this and then go back in. Where was this one? That must have been on a different side. Like here? No? Oh, is that the one? No. We don't really know which puzzle that was, because that should be on this obelisk, right? No clue, but yeah, let's look here on the back again. Yeah, th this might not be the one, the place for it. What the hell? For it. No, there's no way I can see that. So that's not right. All right, well, let's... Uh, I'm just going to read this thing again, because, like, I can't remember it, but I've apparently gotten it. Head up the stairs to the second floor of the greenhouse and enter the room with the red and purple glow. Look through the colored glass here at the room below. Yeah, I, I just don't remember doing that at all. I'll remember when I see it, I suppose. And that makes me think it's also in here somewhere. So, second floor. Wait, this room or... Or the one later on? What would it say? Uh, red and purple glow. I mean, th this is red and purple, isn't it? Or do you mean further in? Ah! Right there, I see. Yeah, I do remember this one now. Okay. Alright. So, let's look at the other one then. Here. It looks kind of similar and like very angular. Kind of goes like... It looks like it's... We're not seeing it... Uh, perpendicular or whatever, or flush against the wall. It's, like, slanted away from the camera or something like that. 
But then, where the hell would that be? Yeah, I would imagine it's in here somewhere. The question is just how to find it. Maybe these pipes or something? This stairwell has been completely pointless, so that would be kind of fun if it had something. Doubt it, though. Oh, man. The bluest room in the fucking universe. <laughs> it's so blue. The other colors are, like, fine. It's just, what the hell are you doing? Alright, I guess I sent it back down by just, like, stepping into that room. But yeah, the other colors feel fine. It's just the blue is just insane. See, so yeah, it's right there. But we can't get more than that. Yeah, I might need a, a hint for this one. Especially since, like, this elevator is really slow if I want to go up and look in, like, the blue-green and green and all of that stuff. Let's get the first hint just to see what it's saying. Or even just this. Kind of fun, nothing too complicated. You will find this one while indoors. I mean, yeah. That's where I am. It seems like it would be here. Let me look at the shape again. I hate that it resets the rotation every time. Starts by going down, and then right, and then like zigzagging up a whole complicated path. But everything is very, very blocky. If we open this one up again... Hmm, indoors, huh? Because, yeah, that there could have been something up here, maybe. Because I did complete this, right? I'm pretty sure I did. What is that puzzle, anyway? I just can't find where the hell that would be. Where it starts by going down, it's like a different shape than anything I've seen on these, uh, on this obelisk. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna grab another one. The puzzle itself is outdoors. Ah, that's a good hint. You, you will find it while you're indoors, but the puzzle is outdoors. Interesting. Okay. That's a good hint. Well, I mean, I guess we have to... Get upstairs, or I could just walk all the way around. Honestly, that might be faster. I just don't like this elevator much. Especially since even just, like, activating it is kind of, uh, tricky. Yeah, let's just go all the way up again and look from that side. Yeah, it could be from in here. That doesn't come come up? Oh, no. Well, I guess I have to go in and do it that way. And this is also, like, super suspicious. Did I not ever do anything with that? Hmm. Yeah, this, this place is weird. Oh! Ah! You will be in here looking out, and because of the green light, this will make a path. Like, from here or something going up. Okay, I see. Yeah, I was, as I was saying, there, there has to be something to these things, because, like, we've seen them, and, like, again, there's 
very little in this game that doesn't have some sort of intent behind it. There's like nothing just placed for no purpose almost. So yeah, we do need the elevator. Alright, well, that was a very good hint. The whole like, you have to be indoors but the puzzle is outdoors. God damn it, wrong one. That makes it quite easy to search for. So, we need to go to green, and oh god, how do we go to green again? Wait, this is- that is green. Like that, yeah. That was the green that we were on. No, wait, that's the green solution, so maybe I need the- the double? Because now I think I'll go past green. Or, right? I mean, I guess I can just walk out, doesn't matter. The elevator will just stop if I pass it. And we run off. There we go. And there it is. Of course. Yep. Nice. That's a really fun one. I like that. And, oh boy. No. Elevator, please! Come back! Alright. Here we are. We're back. And that's done. Nice. Three more to go. But that'll probably take one more episode. I guess I can get started on one because a lot of this is going to get cut out, but it's a little hard to predict how long all of this will take. So, I, I guess I'm just going to go with my instinct and go down to the dock here and get the boat up and see if maybe the boat is used in the swamp instead. Because I, I really have no recollection of using the back circle of the boat to solve a puzzle, and obviously there will be one, it wouldn't just have a circle that you can click and start an environmental puzzle and then not have a, a solution. This was the pool I meant before. Alright. Yeah, it could be here. Ah, uh, I mean, maybe. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, like, it could be this entire thing. That there's, like, some line going up it somehow. Ah, it's the opposite way. Yeah, good. It turned the right way. We have to go here. Yep, 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 yep. I definitely have it. 100%. I bet my life savings on this right there and it joins up here and there it is sweet got it okay i don't know who uh bet against me but i should be pretty rich now all right well uh that was quick should i go for one more or should i just leave it off there because i don't know what else to do now like maybe these are also related to the boat maybe you use the boat like these are just different docking points for the boat or something because, I mean, I guess it kind of would make sense to use it more than once, but I don't know. Uh, so we want to go, like, over here. No, 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 uh, Opposite way. This way. Kind of a nice, happy accident that I found the, like, backside of the boat. Because otherwise this one would have been incredibly difficult to find as well. Yeah, there could be more than one thing here, but we'll see. I can't really, like, get behind the boat here. Yeah, it's harder to see it from here. I can't step onto that. It would be over here? No, even that is not far enough. Yeah. It doesn't seem like I can see over there. This cage is also kind of weird that there's nothing to it except just like aligning these two ladies. I guess that's a kid and a mother maybe? I don't know. Oh! Wait. Wait, that looks super suspicious. That looks extremely suspicious, does it not? But how... How would I make that a circle? That looks so much like... Hold on, let, let me look at the uh, 
the shapes? Yeah, that would be like this one, right? That's definitely that. And it's like, it's when you're rotating it. We have to rotate this, and then while it's rotating... Okay, let's do this one to finish it off, and then, uh... I mean, I guess... I guess I, I still want to go to the resort again, so even if I find the last puzzle in like five minutes, which probably won't happen, but even if I do, we'll still have some stuff to do in like another episode or two, probably one more, but we'll see. So first off, let's do this kind of thing, I guess. And then we start running, and... Where? How? It's, it, yeah, it's right here. Just have to, like, align it somehow. There we go. Yep, got it. It was exactly what I thought. Wait, can I stop it in time? No! Stop! Ah, I can't see it. Ah, oh, well, I can solve it from here. It's fine. Wait, I think it's fine. It's a little hard to do, though, but there we go. And that goes back. All right, cool. So we just have this one left, and I don't know if that's related to this one. I mean, pretty much all of these are completely unrelated. Like, this one is over down here in the basement. The next one is the T platform rotating. Not even not even a T. L. Yeah, did I say T before as well? The L-shaped platform. This one is the boat, backside of the boat. This one is this platform. This one, I don't know. This one is the river here, and then this one is again down in the basement on the other side, so it's a little weird. But I guess it should be relatively close here in that case, but yeah, I'll have to have a look around and we'll probably use some, some clues, but... Very, very close now! Almost, unfortunately, time to say goodbye to the series. Holy hell, let's not get too sentimental now, we'll uh, get plenty of that when I actually am done with it. But thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!